thank you so much for visiting my channel, Lifestyle by Nahama. In today's video, we're gonna be doing a Forever 21 haul for end of the summer and beginning of fall wear. I hope you enjoy all of the outfits that I've put together in this collection. So this is the first outfit I wanna show you. One of the pieces from my haul is this top here. And here is the whole outfit all together. Little street style with the oversized tee with my little blazer, jeans, and these adorable snakeskin wedge sneakers. Um, with this one here, the reason that I like this so much, it's got this cute cutout, it's super soft. It is a little bit of a longer shirt, um, but that's nice because you can either tuck it in, you can wear it over with leggings, however you wanna do it. Um, the sleeves are a really good length for fall. Um, this is actually gonna be, I think, one of my new favorite pieces that I will wear so much but this is this one again go ahead give you a little sass so yeah this is super cute i think i really like this one all right on to the next so here is the next outfit i want to show you this top right here was part of my forever 21 haul the reason that i like it so much is the cuffs on here seem sort of like a peasant top it's super lightweight it is a crop top um, and so I really like this one. Here's the outfit all together. Got my cute little wedge brown shoes on, pair of boyfriend jeans and my little rips. I think this is super cute for um, any sort of like brunch date or, um, you know, girls night out or, you know, anything like that. Um, so yeah, I really like this one. I hope you guys do too. We're on to the next one. All right, so the next piece I'm gonna show you is a super cute cropped uh, sweater top. It's in a really pretty mint green. It's extremely soft, so this feels really, really good on. Um, I would pair it with any sort of really cute leggings, like these have the mesh on the back, um, which I think is really cute, or you could do cutouts, anything like that. And of course, I've got just chunky black, ooh, black sneakers on. Can't stand up straight. Um, so yeah, so this is something I would probably mostly wear around the house just because I do have a little one and so I wouldn't normally go out like this. Um, but if I didn't have her and I just had to like run some errands with the girls or something, I might wear this, but this would definitely be, or even with a cute little pair of like uh, the bicycle shorts, you know, if you bought this. So when I bought it, I read the instructions on how to dry it. And then even though it was still a little damp, I threw it in the dryer so it shrunk up a little bit. So if you want to upsize in something like this, so that you don't have to worry about the shrinking. Um, that's what I would do, but either way, it's still super cute for hanging out in the house or, um, you know, just some, like if I was going to my sister-in-law's house or something like that, you know, then I would probably wear it. But um, yeah, I really like this. Here's the whole thing. All right, on to the next one. This is the next piece I bought. It is a really long shirt. It is definitely tucked in pretty <laughs> tightly to these shorts. Um, and this is super nice because it's, um, being in Texas, we really don't get a lot of fall winter, uh, weather. Um, it kind of goes from summer to uh, winter. So for this, I feel like this is actually good because I can get multiple seasons out of it. It'd be a good layering piece. Um, so here's the outfit. I'm just wearing some scallop shorts with it and these cute little wedge shoes. Um, and I even have a pair of like black leather shorts that I would wear this with, or I have a pair of black leather leggings that I would do this with. Um, maybe a pair of jeans if I tied it up in a certain way. Um, but yeah, so I feel like this is actually pretty versatile through the seasons for us. It's super cute. So yeah, I'm really excited about this one. All right, on to the next one. Okay, so the next piece I want to show you guys is a super cute floral um, bodysuit. It does have a nice little cutout right here, which I absolutely love. And then I paired it with this super cute skirt. Now this skirt does go back a long way with me because this was actually a skirt from mine and my husband's engagement party that I wore. Um, so it's very sentimental to me, so I'm glad that I can pull it out for something else. And then I also have these adorable wedge shoes on. And so here is the full outfit. All right, 
We're gonna move to the last shirt that we got, and then we're gonna move on to our bottom. All right, so this is the last top I got in the Forever 21 haul. Again, it's like a sweatshirt. It does have this different neck style. Um, I'm gonna have to sort of play with it a little bit because I'm not a big fan of things being all up around my neck, but um, I thought I could try it since it's a little looser here. Hopefully that's not gonna be too um, tight. But what I did was I paired it with a cute pair of ripped jeans and then my nice little white sneakers. And so here's this outfit. This is much more of a heavier material than the other uh, shirts that I have shown you guys, um, which I think is gonna be even better for more of the fall winter type of uh, weather. And I think I'll get a lot of use at it through the season. So this is this one. All right, guys, we're gonna move on to the pants. So I'll be back in just a second. All right, you guys, in this outfit, we're doing these adorable olive green cargo shorts. Now they are like a linen material, so they are super soft, super comfortable. Um, I've pulled them up to the higher waistline, paired it with uh, my favorite Guns N' Roses band t-shirt and the little um, jacket here. Now for this, this might be a little more fall for you with these uh, more kind of cute sandals, but you can easily put them with some booties or um, you can even do this with like a leather jacket and it would be super cute. So here is this one. This I think is definitely one of my favorites. Um, yeah, I, I really like it. All right, now we're gonna move on to the two pairs of sweatpants that I got. The next piece in this collection is these super adorable, um, like really mustard yellow uh, sweatpants. Now the thing I like the most is that it's got this, um, like, I don't wanna call it a cutout, but it's like additional fabric here and it's got lining down. So it gives you a little extra um, flare to the side of your pants. Let's see, I wanna see if you can see it a little bit better on the camera there. But yeah, so these are super cute and I paired it with this crop top. I actually made this crop top, so I'm a little biased about it. And then of course, throw on the same chunky sneakers that I had on for some of my other outfits. So yeah, this is this one. All right, guys, we have one pair of sweatpants left. So hold on just a minute. So the last piece in this collection are these super cute, uh, like a blush. They're almost like a blush yet a lavender kind of pink sweatpants. And I paired them with these chunky uh, wedge uh, pink sneakers and my favorite little royalty Disney princess shirt. So this is the last piece in the Forever 21 haul. I think this is super cute too. I mean, these are great for, of course, lounging around the house, running errands. Um, if you could dress it up even with like a white shirt and a cute pair of um, different wedge sneakers and a little jacket and stuff. But yeah, so this is the last outfit. Thank you guys so much for staying tuned and checking out this haul from Forever 21. All the items that I purchased will be linked in the description down below. If you like this video, please subscribe and also give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much, bye.